Then Jonah prayed unto the Lord his God out of the fish's belly, and said, I cried by reason of mine affliction unto the Lord, and he heard me. Out of the belly of hell cried I, and thou heardest my voice. For thou hadst cast me into the deep, in the midst of the seas, and the floods compassed me about, all thy billows and thy waves passed over me. Then I said, I am cast out of thy sight, yet I will look again toward thy holy temple. The waters compassed me about, even to the soul. The depth closed me round about. The weeds were wrapped about my head. I went down to the bottoms of the mountains. The earth with her bars was about me forever. Yet hast thou brought up my life from corruption, O Lord my God. Only in the last century have we discovered that there are towering mountains and deep trenches in the depths of the sea. It turns out, until recently, they thought the bottom of the sea was actually very flat. They thought there were sandy, flat ground extensions from one continent to another. They thought it was completely flat. Remember, this is only until recently. But in 1875, a team of British scientists in the Pacific Ocean found the first of these recesses over five miles deep. They found the first recess, and a few years later, they found another recess about six miles deep. Now that is an incredible depth because, and now the uh, deepest recess known is in Mariana Trench off the coast of Guam and is nearly seven miles deep. This recess is deeper than the highest mountain we know, that's Mount Everest. There is a recess in the deep and the depth of the sea that's higher than Mount Everest. How incredible is that? It turns out that the ocean is full of underwater mountains. If you look at it over here, the pink areas are the deep areas. Uh, I'm not sure if you can see it in the light. These are the pink areas. These are deeper areas in the sea. I'm going to show you a closer look here. Uh, this is, uh, this is um, the Atlantic Ocean and the Caribbean Sea. And this part over here is Florida. The purple sea floor is the deepest part of the Atlantic Ocean. Doesn't this look like mountains under the sea? Unbelievable. Jonah spoke of this. He was talking about the mountains in the sea when, when he was thrown down under. Mountains of the sea, which we only discovered about 150 years ago. Can you imagine somebody 2,000 years ago reading that and saying, this is not scientifically accurate. We know the, the, the bottom of the sea is all flat. Oh, no, it isn't. God knew this thousands of years before. So is the Bible scientifically accurate? Yes. Does it become more comfortable the more you know about science? Yes, it does.